Hello everyone, um, I just wanted to make a quick video for you all, um, I was watching some YouTube videos and there was a guy talking about his skull, um, and before I started mewing, my skull, I had a knot in my head. Well, not a knot, but a dent in my head. My left side of my skull was taller than the right side of my skull. So that made a dent in the middle of my head. And I always wondered, like, why is that there? I didn't know if it came from maybe one of my someone being negligent with me as a child and maybe I had fallen or something like that because it's been there for years you know when I was old enough to really like you know feel in my head and notice that I had because being a female I have hair so when you're a female you really don't men it's a little bit more noticeable because they a lot of them have haircuts and it's easy to tell the shape of a male's head because of the haircut but because I'm a female and um, I had hair on my head I really didn't pay it much attention and it really didn't bother me but I always just kind of wonder like huh why do I have why is my head so so lumpy but it's because I would always sit with my I had poor posture which I'm doing now because I'm still working on that myself but um, I just had really poor posture and I did not properly hold my tongue the way that it should have been placed in my mouth. So I had poor tongue posture and um, I am noticing the effects from that, but I'm not going to cry over spilled milk. I'm just making making improvements from, you know, now that I know what I've been doing wrong, I'm just going to from this day forward, you know, make better decisions and I just wanted to let you all know that and just I just wanted to come on and ask anybody else did they have they noticed that that um you know like different things that they couldn't do before mewing it's crazy how that one little adjustment can change so much because not only that I'm a singer that's what I'm that's what I actually had my computer up and my phone and stuff sit up for because I was making videos. But um I can sing better because of it. Like I honestly can sound my voice sounds so much better now that I've been mewing. I can do runs. I'm sorry, my battery's about to die, so I have to make this quick. I noticed that my runs are so much better, my voice has a better resonance to it because of, you know, the mewing and stuff like that. But yeah, I just want to come on and let you all know to keep up the good work. I'm thinking about doing videos of me mewing, like just random videos to, to let you all know how I keep track of, you know, making sure that I'm on top of it. Because I know sometimes you can forget, you can get involved and begin to be busy and doing you know, day-to-day -day things and you'll f forget. You know, it's very simple, but it's very easy to forget. It's one of those things where, you know, it's, it's something simple and it's something very minor, but it's something serious and it's something very important that you should do. And I just really, I don't know, just, I'm just being, being pulled to do these videos. And when I'm pulled to do something and my instincts tell me to do something, I just do it. And I was just pulled to do these videos and and I honestly I honestly can see the benefits and I can honestly tell the difference. So yeah, I just wanted to, you know, be of service to somebody else and um I hope someone else can take something from this message. And someone left in the comment section the other day on one of my other videos. And if you have not, go check out the other videos that I posted on my channel. But someone left a comment asking me how long have I been mewing. Um, I've been mewing for approximately maybe a month and, and two weeks. I know a month 
I know a month. I know I've been doing mewing for a month strong. And even um, in some of my previous videos, you can tell in the videos, like if you go to my first video, you can tell the progress just by going to my previous videos. And if you follow me on social media, um, my Instagram is Amaria Jasmine underscore. You can go follow me on Instagram and you can look at my videos and my pictures and just literally you can see the growth and progression for yourself. Um, it tracks back all the way to 2016. So you'll get a chance to see me and my improvements from 2016 to 2020. So it'll give you a better insight on how much um my facial structure have changed and yeah my phone is about to die so I just wanted to make this quick video and let you all know that we're gonna get this this ball on the road and leave a like and a comment and I'll be posting another video bye she got me cars for his ass with that love I guess only time comes you gotta give me dirty love I guess I'm not to. When I can't find any words, I lie. Like I can see the stars in the perfect land.